okay you know how the internet just loves to give trouble so i got <laughs> i got signed off <laughs> i don't know what happened there but i just got signed off so i'm trying it again all right let me make sure everything is working and i'm back on properly all right i think i'm back on i think it's working right let me try this one more time internet love me please love me please all right so i'm putting on i'm putting it onto my group which is called destiny financial solutions again so let me just make sure that it's actually working yes okay cassia's up. hi my darling cassia right it's working it's working perfect hi 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 all right so as i was saying first thing first okay my name is leticia Silver barrett i'm the team leader destiny planners we help entrepreneurs like yourself understand how to properly record their business expenses record um register their businesses teach you how to record your finances thereby helping you understand how to properly reduce your business your business that's now eh? that's now your business taxes at the end of the, the year all right so today we are going to talk about investment and saving because on monday fcb mentioned that they will put in their shares on for sale and I had a big discussion in my group about um, it's on Tuesday about how to how to analyze things like that when you see businesses put up their shares for sale and what are the necessary things so tomorrow in the group I'm going to go into detail in some of the important points that you're supposed to look at in terms of on the company's financial Counts. What are the ratios, and what you're supposed to pay attention to know if this purchase it will be a valuable one for you to go into. So, as I was saying earlier on, before the internet gave me trouble, most working class people their first investment is usually their pension or annuity. What I would like to find out is how many of you still have an active pension or annuity plan. If you are still constantly paying for it or if you do like some people will start it up things get rough will end up either canceling it or maybe just let it die and don't go back and verify if you have anything existing yes you need a pension plan it's important that you have that don't just rely on the government giving you an NIS pension or even the social welfare pension you yourself have to start thinking about your future and what you want your future to look like so today I want to discuss some steps to take to increase your investment and saving portfolio right because as I said I notice entrepreneurs usually complain that they don't have money but it's not that you don't have money that's not the truth the fact is that you don't know how to manage your funds correctly yes you have to look into that cassia i don't worry we will reach there just now now is tell you what to do and who to go by and how much to start it up as. because as a ltd as cassia just mentioned you can pay yourself through the you have to make you can make the company pay for your pension for you as a ltd so yes so i will show you and that would be a good deduction um a, a big good business deduction for tax wise to reduce your taxes yes you remember reduce the taxes right so we are going to go through the seven steps that i think entrepreneurs still up to now don't deem important for them when they start or begin their business right so the first thing is again automate and separate your bank accounts so 
least, at least you could have like a a savings a checking and an investment account so you separate you can separate the money so say for instance you do an invoice for a client and let's say the invoice is a thousand dollars from that thousand dollars income you're bringing you separate 10 percent into savings and you separate 10 percent into investment automatically you don't think about oh gosh i wonder if i go make the rest yes you will have some times that again as entrepreneurs here trying to make the money to make ends meet for you personally but think about also your future you want to be better have something that when hit retirement age reach you can at least have something to fall back on to live a luxurious retirement age because you don't want when you reach you know let me say 70s and you're still working hard like if you're in your 30s 40s so again management planning important right a second thing that i still up to this day and age you all as entrepreneurs clean forget you all don't pay yourself only today i went by a client and she say, well i don't pay myself because um i don't see i have a need to but oh gosh only need to do that why it is why it is you start the company you didn't start the company so that you could be financially free so you gotta pay yourself even if hi jason even if it's two hundred dollars a month something oh gosh only pay yourself after you think of it after all that hard work you're putting to start this baby and you still don't want to pay yourself yes there are rules of thought that you have to wait 10 years and all kinds of this but life different no you can't think like that that was the old way of thinking please pay yourself please 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 you miss nothing much i now reach point two jason so even if you go back the point one was to separate your your money and automate again everything online we're using online stuff which is say for instance you do an invoice for a thousand dollars you separate one one set into your checking account ten percent into your savings and ten in your investment that's the only thing you missed so far right jason right and then the second point which was about paying yourself which i know you should be doing that <laughs> so i don't have to both you for that <laughs> right your third point is again when you open that savings account make sure you have no access to the money when i say no access no credit card no debit card attached to that money especially if you are one that you know for sure know for sure for yourself you would not be religious and you don't have that self-control to not go dig in that savings account don't attach no card no zero zero no card i don't want no card to that account so you can actually see that account grow and make money for you if it is you can't do it for yourself get an accountability partner get a mentor somebody could just keep you in track so you don't fall by and you don't let this opportunity fall by so you, you won't be able to really keep yourself on track and do the writing and make you be able to save the money and get more money the fourth point take advantage of all the tax credits i keep stressing on this today on my group i i, I drop a, vid, a video about it because i realize till for all citizens are not aware we have 11 you hear the word i use 11 tax credits that we can use i'm going to drop it right now in the comment we have 11 tax credits we can use 11 that you can use and actually take full advantage and use it to your benefit and get some reduce your taxes some more again mindset is important mindset is very very important people you don't realize how much as an individual your mindset help you to get where you're going and tr get you moving on the right track that's very very important anything in life i'm going to interject here like for instance with my eldest son he was a little frustrated in school because 
he wasn't seen he he was we we set a goal as 95 to reach to for him to do his C because he's doing C exam May the 4th so that's his set goal and he was frustrated because he's not seen yeah he's not seen him reaching his target goal in school so I decided on my own self I talked to the teacher and asked him if I could keep him home some days during the week and I will push him and within this is the second week he home and my gosh I go like mindset is everything I am encouraging him and I have seen him move from <laughs> where was he in his he was in his 30s and now he waking back his 90s and he as I walked through the door this afternoon he was like mommy I get 92 so I was like that is something that again make my heart raise make me get excited because you realize once you could push somebody else and how important mindset is mindset is so vital he's only 11 and i know he does always say mommy use my biggest hero my biggest superstar but i know mindset means everything and i need entrepreneurs to understand that mindset is everything once you get that mindset on track oh you will just see things just unfold and just everything just open up it'll be like little sparkles just happening again a sidetrack <laughs> so then we'll go back to point five passive income that is very very important you need to make money make money for you literally because money is an energy so you have to know in your earlier stage in business to be aggressive in an in investment so that in your later years you can reap the benefits of that m investment that you put in prioritize your savings that's important so that in the later years you get it right <laughs> yes <laughs> right a simple little quote I'm going to leave with you if you are faithful with the little you will be faithful with plenty your stewardship of money is important important very very important the sixth point invest in the stock market your shares why are you investing in say you're going to grocery i go i go on i'm going both local and international so for instance locally you're buying stuff at massey let me see what's penny wise why not invest shares and those kind of companies or let's go foreign you're buying you're spending your money on your brands like nike adidas macy's why don't instead of just spending money and they getting that benefit from the profit invest in their shares when you hear those kind of companies have sales for the shares invest in it look like my biggest goal if ever google ever put and say they have and I could afford to buy a Google share. I want a Google share or even a Coca-Cola share. Hello, they're making money. <laughs> I can tell everybody who buy a bottle of Coca-Cola or buy or using Google. I know for sure I gain a little small money from that. While I sleep and I'm making money. Again, wise investments. <laughs> wise investments. And of course the last but not least, the seventh investment you'd always make and you know for sure that making money land land don't depreciate it never does it will always increase in value and especially when it is in the right location even better as time go by and facilities change or um, the neighborhood change of course the value gonna go up tremendously if you already realize years ago when certain areas was is only bush now you go back and you pass, you're seeing mansions building. When you watch the value of those property or that piece of land or the house, millions of dollars for a two bedroom, but it's the land that have the value and the area and the, cause the place build up. Yes, FCB have some shares out for sale, but again, you have to watch the financial statements and see how it's going. And yes, they will be selling because they need to get capital in but how good is the profit at the end of the year and how good is the borrowing ratio and the various dividends ratio and all these things you will see that tomorrow tomorrow we're going in hard with that jason on the group 
you will see tomorrow I'll be lacing some points and I think I, I think I have it again for next week to tell you some of the important ratios to look out for so you know how to do the proper calculations when you're looking at these type of investments when you see places like that say they're having sale on shares so you know exactly what you're about you know how you do your calculations what to look for what what um what are the pointers to be alert with so that come in piece by piece i can't give you too much in one night because i don't want all the head to blow off and but oh god this girl came out to watch so i'm trying to give it in small drifts small tips small tips a little bit as my grandma used to say a little goes a long way <laughs> So I'm doing the same. A little goes a long way. So every day I drop a little bombshell and say, okay, take take that, absorb it, and then move on. Any other questions? Anybody have any questions? Any issues? Anybody have any points they want to lay out or ask? <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> no problem, Jason. When you're ready, you come. You know what? This is all about sharing and helping you all understand. <laughs> yes, yes, show some love, show some love. I love you all with all my heart and I'm glad that I have what you call great entrepreneurs that ready to move from ground zero to just explode. We, we're going in hard, we're going in hard, gold crushing 2017. Yeah, we showing you how to do everything right from start to finish. <laughs> now, Cassia can't use up all the love. She have plenty more love to share. That's my guild. That's my another accountability partner, you know. See, that's important. Not because I could give you all these awesome ideas. I don't have somebody else to give my little light. See, she's my next accountability partner. My two lovely boys, my next accountability partners, especially the younger ones. He, he just come up with some more crazier ideas than the older one, but yes. So, the younger generation is going to change the way of entrepreneurship totally. I, I, I am seeing it. I'm seeing it. So, thank you, wonderful people, for coming to listen to me. Don't forget, we have... On March 25th, we have in our business plan course. You can go on our website and register. Oh, yes, and I get my new website just now. Well, I shouldn't say my, my updated website just now. Thanks to Natalie. Oh, God, I have to big up that girl. I love she too bad, yes. Oh, too much, too much. But new things coming, new things. Destiny plans again doing another change. But don't worry, it's a change. Everything does come. In small bits and just come out big and bad so you all have a good night see you all tomorrow tomorrow is Tuesday yes yes tomorrow is Tuesday so the week almost up I hope you all are crushing all your financial goals for the week thus far and also crushing your March goals financial goals being crushed and you all maximizing and slaying March like a boss do have a great night. Goodbye. Bye.